Welcome to the featured video of order approval for WooCommerce. Order approval extension offers you a seamless solution to manually validate new orders. Approve or reject orders and accept order payment upfront or after the order approval. You can enable validation for all orders or specific orders based on user roles and products in the shopping cart. Let's go to the back end and create a new order approval rule to see how it works. Go to Order Approval and click on Add New. Add rule title for future reference. Select if you want to receive payment upfront when the order is placed, or if you want to accept payment once the order is approved by the store admin. We select Wait for Approval so the customer will place an order without being charged. Select user roles for whom you want to enable the order validation. Leave empty for all users. You can apply this rule on all or specific products, categories, and tags. We will select Apply on all products option here. Add rule priority and click on Publish. You can add multiple order approval rules as per your business needs. Let's go to the Visual Timeline tab to customize order approval notices for customers. Here you can enable Visual Timeline on the Order Detail page to keep customers informed about their order approval status. Customize labels and colors of Waiting for Approval, Approved, and Rejected stages. You can also set a color for default order statuses. You can enable or disable the Order Cancel button as per your business needs. Customize labels of Cancel and Pay button and select colors for button text and background. Customize notices displayed on Order Success page and Checkout page for before and after order approval rules. Let's go to the front end to see how this works. Since we have applied order approval to the entire catalog, we can see the order approval message appearing on the checkout page to let customers know that the orders are subject to approval and payment will be made after approval. Once the order is placed, the approval message is displayed on the thank you page. Now go to order detail page in my account section and click on view option. You can see the order status displayed here. Let's go to the admin panel and approve this order. You can approve orders using the bulk action or from the order detail page. Since the order has been approved, you can see the pay button appearing on the order detail page to let customers pay for the order. From the extension settings, you can also customize the email notifications that are sent to customer and store admin when the order is placed and requires validation. You can also customize and automatically send email notifications to customers when their order is approved or rejected. From the Deactivation tab, you can choose to assign specific standard order status when the extension is uninstalled. That's the end of the video. Thank you for watching.